Hello, Explorers fans. Welcome to a new edition, a brand new season here of Feature Friday on Go Explorers TV. I'm your host, David Grzbowski. With me from the men's soccer team, we have Jason Plumoff. Jason, welcome to the show. First of the year, how's it feel? Feels great. Thanks for having me. We're getting a little bit behind the scenes of what Jason was like growing up and why he came here at LaSalle. First things first, for those of you who don't know, uh, Jason grew up in Germany. Talk about that journey from Germany to the United States. Um, it was a big transition. I mean, growing up in a different country and then moving here. Coming to America gave me a, still a chance to develop later in my years because I think an athlete doesn't develop fully until he's like 18, 19, 20. But mm -hmm. in Europe, they sort of sort you out when you're already like 13, 12. Oh, yeah. And what's the transition like going from coming here at 15, mm -hmm. you only had a couple of years, and then you're here at LaSalle. Talk about how you chose LaSalle and uh, how you progressed to become a LaSalle explorer. Well, um, one of the main reasons I came here was the coaching staff. Uh, Coach Pat Farrell and Bobby Wilkinson are uh, great people, not just as coaches, but off the field. They're very good mentors, and um, that was probably the main reason I came here. Second reason was academics. I liked, I liked the campus, I liked the teachers, I liked everything about LaSalle. So. We'll get into the season in just a brief moment. 3-0 start, a great start for this year's team, uh, beating Mount St. Mary's, uh, Loyola, and as well as Drexel. Mm -hmm. uh, talk about the progression you've seen from this year's team back from your freshman to compare to now. You guys didn't really have a good start off to each season, mm -hmm. but this year is totally different. Yeah, we have a good group of leaders this year. Our captains, uh, Glenn Roy and Tommy Kalpokas, um, really helped us off to get on a good start this year because the fa past few seasons, I mean, sorry, like 0 and 6. So it was real important to start off well because we know we can do we can do well in the A-10s. So having a better result in our first few games would help us for the A-10s. Um, and it, it's worked out. I mean, we beat Drexel, which is a good opponent. We went down to Maryland, beat Loyola, and we just beat Mount St. Mary's. So. You know, you talked about you played Drexel, a good, great opponent, Mount St. Mary's was your most recent game. Mm -hmm. You had a hand in both of those games, the game-winning goal. Talk about the, uh, the PK and the end of the St. Mary, uh, Mount St. Mary's game, and talk about that dance you guys had at the end, a little Macarena action, wow. like, uh, in the goal celebration. Yeah, yeah. Um, well, Jadel played me a great ball. Um, all the defenders weren't expecting it, and he kind of slipped it in behind their center back, and when I was through, it was either he was going to score, he's going to take me down. So he took me down. And um, I feel pretty secure about PKs, so I stepped up and scored. And the night before, we were actually talking about celebrations because uh, we watched one of our favorite soccer players do that celebration. Who's, who's and, that? Uh, Neymar, he plays in Brazil. Okay. So it's Macarena, sort of Brazilian like. You guys matched it perfectly for the yeah. highlights. Knowing going to this weekend is going to be a tough matchup. Uh, uh, what's the mindset like going with school the week and having the weekend to go into uh, two tough games? Well, school, school. You got to take care of that first because mm -hmm. you're a student athlete. But um, we're not scared of anyone. I mean, we tied the national finalists last year and we gained a lot of respect from that. And uh, you can see from everyone's uh, aura when they approach our field that they're that it's going to be a tough game. They know that. We fight all 90 minutes and that uh, we're going to leave everything on the field. So Now before we wrap up Feature Friday, we get to know you a little more here on campus. Uh, favorite dining hall? Favorite dining you hall? You like to eat at, maybe the whole team likes to eat at. I know we see you guys on campus um, eating together. We usually go to Treetops. We kind of stay away from B&G. We'll, we'll be at the Union too. Um, the Union is really nice this year. They did a lot to it, redid it, mm -hmm. put in Subway. Coach loves Subway. He has a subway card, his discount card. That's that's his thing. He loves subway. Right, who's the uh, funniest person on the team? You have one. Who's that one guy that stands out? Is um, it yourself or are you? A no, or? no. No. Nah. Roy, maybe. Uh, I'll definitely go with Jeff Pio. Okay. Um, he's a real good guy on and off the field, so he's definitely the funniest. All right, that will do it for us here on Feature Friday with our first Jason Plumoff from the men's soccer team signing off here on Feature Friday.